from such yeah. an enthusiastic audience, we thought, do you know what? Hey, we we'll let them interview Sue. That's right. what we'll do. We'll pass the buck. <laughs> so we've got George in the audience. Now, George, um, you record yourself, don't you, watching Game of Thrones? Yes. And then you put your reactions on YouTube. Why do you do that? Um, <laughs> basically, because, so I hadn't seen Game of Thrones until about just over two years ago. Everyone was talking about it. Yeah. I was like, I'm not going to watch it. I don't like medieval stuff. I'm not watching it. It's overhyped. My friend was like, just watch one episode. And people have sat with me watching TV and like stuff like Titanic. I get a little bit emotional, a little bit angry. And so they were like, you should react in like Gogglebox. It'd be funny. So I was like, oh, I'll do one, you know, see how it goes. And then from there, I ended up doing yeah, every single So my, my question to you would be, um, there's a very, very, very extreme, shocking scene, season four, mm -hmm. the reigns of customer, the Red Wedding. Yeah. How, what was your reaction? like to that could you reenact could you do a little bit of it now give me some of those facial expressions i don't mean to take you off but it was season three. Oh! oh. 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 <laughs> go on send the chair go on you can sit here We've actually got some footage of, um, of george oh god actually in the throes of game oh, of yeah. thrones here, we, here he is you can't hold my baby up Very emotional. Uh, now, George, yeah. you have a question that you would like to ask Superkins. Yes. So, I'm a massive Targaryen fan, the whole family. I just love them. This will make no sense to people who've never seen no. Game of Thrones. My mum's watching, it. she's like, I've no idea what you're talking about, but I'll watch it. Um, so, you're a big Targaryen fan? Yes, huge yep. Targaryen fan, and I'm obsessed with the Mad King. Yes. So my question is about uh, in the early hours before his death. Yes. Mm. Burn them all, burn them in their homes, burn them in their beds. Was he actually crazy or are we seeing a vision of that he saw a vision of the future with the White Walkers and is telling everyone to burn the bodies of the dead? So you think he was sort of some way prophetic and saw that the only way to save the whites was to torch them? Yes. Maybe Blood Bran <laughs> walked into him. OK. Because we know he did it last I time. I think he was just cuckoo, if I'm honest Do with you. you. Well, because oh. I think there's, there's, already a, there's already a character in there who's yeah. walking and shaking things. Oh, Shall we leave them to it? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, leave them to, to, be, to be honest, yeah. if he's doing that, what's the point I of Maggie what, the Frog? You two go and have a conversation. Yeah. We are just going to move <laughs> this on. Uh, we're going to tell you that Thronecast War Room <laughs> is on Sky Atlantic at 9 o'clock on the 8th of April. We'd have done for this all in of you, Cantonese, you'd have understood. <laughs> yes, for all of you who are looking forward to the series, enjoy it, people. Yes, enjoy it.